What is Huzur's opinion about the scent of the Shia people? Should we consider them as saints? Whereas uh, obviously they do not believe in the Hilafat of the first three Khalifas. As what? As uh, sects? Saints of Shia. Saints. Yes. This is a belief which is wrongly attributed to them. None of the Ahimma of Shia disbelief in the continuity of Khilafat. And we have strong evidence from some of them who loathe the idea that uh, the previous Khilafat were not pious. And other Imam Jafar Sadiq or Imam Bakr, I think it was, Imam Bakr, who is on record, on Shia, in Shia literature on record, I've shown his extreme anger at someone who, who praised him but said a few words of disrespect against the first Khulafa. He was extremely angry with him and said those who, f who were foremost in their belief in the Holy Prophet, who helped them in all the difficulties, you dare to say a word against them? You God-fearing, pious people. So this idea of separation between Khilafat Ali and the previous Khalifa was born much later in the Shia Ummah, not at all in the beginning when the Imamat was intact. It it must have got inflate, infiltrated into Shia beliefs after the 12th Imam, not before. Because all these 12 Imams, as are known in history, they have expressed themselves in dogmas and religious practices, etc. They all appear to be very pious people, God-fearing people, who never D discriminated between Hazrat Ali and other Khalifa. There's no evidence whatsoever. And even Hazrat Ali did not. <coughs> it all begins with him. If he had done so, then of course there was a likelihood of those who followed him to have repeated his attitude towards the previous Khalifa. He ex had extended his hand in bath of obedience to all the three who, who were before him. So what sort of Khalifa that he was if he himself had made himself obedient to the previous Khalifa? If he had not believed them to be Khalifa, how could he extend his hand for bath of these Khalifa? Then instead of Hazrat being the chief of immigrants, Ali Woodcourt should have been entitled as chief of hypocrites because he took bath at the hand of the chief of hypocrites. So he was a greater chief. All this is rubbish. All this is an insult to the dignity of Khulafa and particularly the dignity of Ali and his status with God. He was a God-fearing person. He, did not, he was not afraid of any humans. And whatever he did, he did it after deciding about the truth, uh, about the deciding, after deciding about the pros and cons of the thing, and uh, having come to the conclusion that what he was doing was right in the sight of God. So before ex doing bad of Abu Bakr, he must have gone through all this assessment. assessment mental procedure of assessment, must have finally decided that he is the rightful Khalifa, so he should do better.